Hi there. Today in this video, we're going to have a little look at the experimental dice treatment that we have running above ATT. So the aim of this and why would be if you're trying to emulate in some manner online the experience you get when you're in person where you're able to see someone else's dice roll. Now, if you look up here on the top right hand side, the game log currently has nothing there. When I move to the settings panel down the bottom, there's stream dice rolls and there's a little disclaimer saying that the dice will start small then grow larger as we start to buffer and hold it now once i've done this what this then enables us to do is go back into our log and we'll now see that this dice stream disabled does appear whereas previously it was missing when i click enabled as a player i now have this within my game log dice stream disabled if i select this when I roll my player dice, you can see it rolls there. As a DM, I can kind of see this. What I'm about to show you is how you'd see what would be visible for you when someone else is playing with it. So if I now highlight uh, the second character I have off screen, so when I move on to here and enable the dice streaming, you will see that I roll the dice. And the score comes up. The mirror does well when I'm rolling. You can start to see the dice get a little bit bigger. And the reason that one has gone from Frith is because I haven't gone back onto his tab and allowed it to, to dissipate. So if I then select it again, you'll see the dice are now a larger size. So you can see how it represents what I talked about at the beginning, where they start off small, but after a few rolls, they get up to normal size. And that's how we go. If I disable dice streaming, then what will happen will be that I can roll a dice. and you just don't see it. So that is how we um, use and enable dice streaming in above VTT. I can disable here, I can go into here, remove that, the player no longer has the option within the game log, and we continue as normal. Thank you very much.